I am Isaac Stubblefield, and I'm here to talk about Gallow Hills by Lois Duquesne and Mysteries of the Salem Witch Trials by Mark Arson. Both books, in my opinion, were very good books, but I prefer one over the other. I prefer the nonfiction book, The Mysteries of the Salem Witch Trials by Mark Arson, because it includes a lot more facts and a lot more viewpoints of the Salem Witch Trials instead of just one viewpoint and how the person who wrote the book believes it to happen. Uh, Mysteries of the Same Witch Trials also includes much more facts about the witch trials and much more in-depth research within the trials. Gallo Hills includes many controversial issues such as religion. There are Christians in the book, there is someone who believes in reincarnation, and someone who doesn't believe in anything. These all play into a factor of someone being accused as a witch, as the person who doesn't believe anything is accused to be as a witch by the Christians. Sometimes I just prefer fact over fiction, and this is one of those times. I do prefer Mysteries of the Sandwich Trials over Gallo Hills.